So how many of you wish you had a smart TV? If you do, and you want one, all you have to do is get the Sungale Cloud TV box. This little guy right here. You have access to all the latest streaming services such as Netflix, YouTube, Google Play Store, Vudu, just like you'll find with Roku TV and Apple TV, plus tons of free content. So, uh, so when we look at the Cloud TV box itself, you can see its small size. As we, as we look on the side, we have three USB ports and a micro SD. In the back, you have an AV output for older TVs. You have your Ethernet port, you have your HDMI cable, your power port, and of course, you have your power button and your IR transmitter. This has a 1.6 gigahertz dual core processor and four gigabytes of internal memory, plus one gigabyte of RAM. One of the most strongest platforms available for smart TV boxes. All right, so the way you navigate the smart TV box is with Philips UWAN remote, which is specially designed for smart TVs. So you have four infrared cameras that work with the infrared detector in front of the cloud TV box. So as you can see, the cursor, when my wrist moves, the cursor on the screen moves as well. Now, so once the cloud TV box loads, you'll come to the main interface. The first thing you wanna do is click on Wi-Fi at the bottom right and turn on your Wi-Fi. Click on, select your network and put in your password. Once connected, you'll be able to access all the different internet features of the Cloud TV box. So the first thing you're gonna do when you turn on your Cloud TV box is uh, check out the upper left-hand corner. You have internet TV. When you go into this area, you have access to 70 different channels. The bottom down here, and this area is what you have preloaded. So if it's up in this content, then you have access to it. So for example, if you click on Lifetime or you drag and scroll, you have news channels such as Fox News. If you click on Fox News, you can access all the latest videos of the day in terms of news. So for example, if you click any of these stories, it will send you right to that story. Delaying deportations, maybe millions of them. Democratic Congressman Luis Gutierrez, he's so confident. Um, next, you have uh, the streaming area. So you have YouTube. This would be a uh, content that you have uh, a subscription to, like Netflix. So for example, if you click on Netflix, you see the entire platform is available to you. So you click any one of these movies, like Pirates of the Caribbean, for example. Just press the play button right here. Gives you kind of a quick idea what the movie is about, the star rating. And once it's loaded, it'll just start streaming. Next, you have your streaming backup list or streaming plus at the top. This is where you have access to all the latest video hubs. So for example, Hulu Plus, IMBD, like all the popular streaming services, you have access to those. Next, uh, we'll go into XBMC. This is, a, so you have one channel, Ice Films, Mashup. These are kind of like the most popular ones available. So if, for example, you click one channel. So example, most popular, highly rated, featured. So if you click on featured. So as you can see, you can see all the different videos available. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Book Thief, Hercules, Chef, Godzilla. So just an example, you can, this is kind of what you can access on XBMC. Also, besides uh, Netflix, and next you have all your different social media applications, Facebook, Twitter at the bottom, Instagram, Skype if you connect a webcam to this, TuneIn Radio. So if we click into TuneIn Radio, you're going to access 15,000 different radio stations. So for example, you click local radio at the top. They'll give you all the local radio stations for that area. And you have access to scroll through all these and just once you find like a favorite, you click onto it. And within a couple seconds, it'll start streaming that radio station. Down here at the bottom pen, you have your browser for internet surfing. So if you want to do a Google search or just interested in doing a quick search, 
you have access to that right there. You have your news with uh, several different uh, backup archives. You click on one, you can see all the latest stories or new, uh, new content that that news source has put out. It's very easy to navigate. Next, you have your video pictures and music. These are if you have anything stored on a micro SD card, a thumb drive, or external hard drive, or the four gigabytes of internal memory. You have games right here. You have all your latest uh, Android games if you go into the backup list. All right, so for example, if you're a Candy Crush fan, you can have Candy Crush on your TV. So a couple steps to download it and you have access to it. Next, you have uh, education. So if you want to learn with your kids, you have several different ways to learn with your kids on your TV. You also have the Google Play Store down here. You can download thousands of apps including books, news, movies, TV shows. Finally you have a menu in the top corner. You have several different blocks including internet TV, streaming, user apps, and system apps. So if you go into internet TV, you have all your different um, TV uh, channels that you've installed. You go into streaming, user Finally, you have this area right here. The latest movie streaming to your device. So if you click on, you may come to a kind of a notification like this. So to bypass it, you go into the upper right corner, request desktop site, and it should clear up the problem. And down here at the bottom, if you want to go full screen, you just click that button right there. And so another thing about these uh, Cloud TV boxes are they are Miracast compatible. So to access Miracast, that means you could do mirroring from your uh, cell phone or tablet to the screen. So you'd go to Wi-Fi or Settings, and click in the Wi-Fi at the top. Make sure your device is uh, connected to both device, your cell phone, tablet, and the Cloud TV box the same network. You'd go to the top corner, Wi-Fi Direct. And then on your device, you'd uh, select the um, Cloud TV Boxes device as your uh, wireless display. And what's connected, you have access to everything on your screen. So like you can see, my tablet screen and the TV screen are exactly the same. So if I want to do a YouTube video, it's like a pretty much a motion, uh, motion control remote control or a TV remote control. So it's very easy to play, like your favorite content. And that's Miracast. Same screen. Same screen.